Roman Avchinikov, Security Vision. I'd like to talk about SOC technologies that are considered obsolete. And I want to say that a ticketing platform as a technical solution is an outdated platform for modern security operations centers. In short, why? Because it simply does not correspond to the current demands and realities of SOCs. For a more detailed answer, let's drive into history a bit. When the first SOCs began to appear as full-fledged functional structural divisions, all architects, designers, methodologists, writers of standards and business projects always said that there should be a ticketing platform in the core of the SOC. This sounds logical overall. We must keep records of identified cybersecurity incidents and monitor their handling. This is how a ticketing solution for information security was born. What was ticketing at that time? It was a platform that automatically registered cyber incidents manually or through simple integrations. It had some kind of simple status model that could be switched. This is how incidents were registered. That is, at that time a ticketing platform was a kind of analog of Excel. Then SOCs developed and groups of information security specialists and the center of expertise appeared within a SOC. Ticketing systems had to meet these challenges, and as a result, a kind of workflow appeared in them. It allowed interaction between groups of specialists, escalation of cyber incidents and so on. That is, ticketing evolved a little. What came next? As I said, groups of information security specialists of different levels appeared in SOX. The main expertise and the most experienced specialists went to the third level of incident handling. At the initial levels there were people with less competence. It became necessary to somehow transfer the expertise of third level specialists to their less experienced colleagues. It was necessary to make people understand how to react to this or that incident. Thus, playbooks appeared, in which it was clearly written if incident A happened, do this, if incident B happened, do that, and so on. A kind of symbiosis of ticketing systems and playbooks appeared. They can be combined or they can be regarded as separate things. And then SOCs began to live on playbooks and used them a hundred times. Then everyone got tired of playbooks and realized that the automation of playbooks was required. Three elements appeared – ticketing, playbook and automation. At the junction of these functional elements a new class of solutions emerged – incident response platforms and their further stage of development – security orchestration automation and response solutions. And since modern IRP SOAR solutions include ticketing functionality, and besides it a lot of other useful things, in the classical sense ticketing is not needed in a modern SOC, because, firstly, ticketing does not allow to implement playbook automation. Secondly, it does not allow to integrate all sources of information about an incident. SAM, mail, triggering of cybersecurity tools, anti-fraud incidents, etc. Besides, simple ticket management systems are in most cybersecurity tools of a SOC, for example, in CM software. 